getting with each other. One is a hen, uh, sorry, it's a cock, and a uh, chicken, chicken cock. And here is the, the peacock, uh, peafowl. We don't know, still don't know uh, the sex uh, of this. But they are getting along. I am so happy that they are getting along with each other. In the beginning, this chicken was bossing on my peahen, my peahen chick. Now, now it seems like they are speaking to each other. It's cute, cute, isn't it? Uh, my peahen chick may look shabby, but. This cutie has got such a long neck and it looks elegant. And this chicken is, has got the crown, pretty crown. Both of them are very much interested in knowing each other. So cute. The hen on the other side, the chicken hen, it is observing, observing this, this uh, very special moment. And maybe she even she is willing to join. Tell me, who is cuter? Who is having the pretty looks? Obviously, it seems like it is the chicken. Ah. What happened is, yesterday was, as usual, my peahen was sleeping along with me after the food and pooping and etc. etc. everything. It was uh, the night routine, long sleep that that the peahen was doing and these two chicken hen and the uh, cock both they were uh, roaming all around the uh, all around the floor of the room all of a sudden i got up i got up in the middle of the night only to find the hen and the cock sitting right on the blanket where on the blanket wherein beneath the black blanket the pea hen was there uh, it did fly off the pea hen was there it was chipping in the in in the sleep i guess and these two chicken they had sensed it and they they had somehow reached it exactly the point where exactly mm. Mm. beneath the blanket this cutie was sleeping along with me <laughs> what a wonderful moment it was I was in uh, too sleepy and could not capture that uh, that one that moment I got them both the chicken hen and cock locked up in their the coop and me and my peahen chick went back to sleep so we do give a give a uh, your comment on this cute video that of me and my pets pet birds dog is not allowed why because I cannot trust my doggy it goes along with the those 
domesticated birds say for example the chicks and the and the the ducks duck chicks and the ducks grown up ones it goes along with them they are very good friends i wonder why exactly yeah when it comes to these wild birds it gets crazy my dog so i cannot trust my dog so my dog is locked up outside this room so that's it about my pets this wild bird cannot be my pet for long it is going to fly off once it gets a complete flying capability even though it feels like escaping out into the wild only to get hunted down by the predators so i need to take care of this bird until many more months to come at least 4 to 5 months once it reaches that age uh, it will be eligible to live on its own i guess or some other uh, fowl of e fowl will adopt adopt this otherwise it's very tough it's very tough we do it because so many mongoose and wild cats are attacking the pea pe fowl and uh, i am observing so many carcass of pea hens especially pea cocks are not found uh, i have found uh, two three of them all the wings um, and the bones and etc one of them is shown in the uh, in one of my previous video you can watch it and find out it's happening very bad and sad that's it have a nice day have a nice night if you, if you are going through the, uh, the night hours catch up with the with my next video